Okay, we're gonna prepare a mustalevria, a, a kind of traditional uh, Greek uh, pudding made uh, of uh, grapes, uh, grape uh, syrup. Three, four glasses of water into a bowl. Then uh, th this is the Greek, uh, the grape syrup. Pour it in, uh, into one glass. Pour one glass of uh, grape syrup into the four glasses of water. Stir thoroughly until they mix well. <coughs> Take a pan, okay, put uh, half the mix into the pan. Now, uh, on the, uh, with the other half. Put it slowly, put the flour slowly while mixing all, all the time, st while stirring all the time into the water syrup mix until the flour dissolves with a spoonful at a time and stir thoroughly. Until it, until it becomes a homogeneous mix. So here is uh, half uh, our uh, grape syrup with water uh, mixture uh, with uh, the um, uh, flour uh, well uh, mixed in. Uh, the other half uh, without the flour is uh, currently being brought to, to the boil. Uh, while we wait uh, for uh, the thing to boil, let's prepare uh, the bowls where uh, the pudding will be served. Just choose uh, six uh, small bowls and place in each one of them some sesame seeds and some walnuts just uh, one walnut uh, crushed uh, by hand uh, on its uh, ball and some cinnamon The, uh, the first half of our mixture is about to boil. We pour in some cinnamon, about a fistful of uh, crushed walnuts. and a large spoonful to almost three spoonfuls, spoonfuls of sesame seeds. Mix them all together. And now this is our special uh, herb 
It's uh, a special Greek herb called Arbaroriza, but uh, you can use uh, ginger instead. Now pour the mixture with the, um, uh, into the boiling pot, stirring thoroughly and continuously. Keep on stirring. The mixture will get thicker as you stir it. After about uh, 10 minutes uh, of stirring under uh, hot, uh, uh, quite hot, uh, you can see that it gets uh, more thick and it's ready to be pulled into uh, the balls. Fill the balls with the mixture. And let it cool. Be careful it's hot. Level the mixture on each ball. And finish by sprinkling cinnamon on each ball. and my seeds. Caliorexia.